Good evening, everybody. How are you tonight? Good evening, teacher. Hi, Erlene. How are you? Good evening. Hey, Katia. Good evening. How are you? Fine, fine, teacher. And you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking, all right? Let's see who else is here. Oh, Marta. Good evening, Marta. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Let's see. All right. Good evening, teacher. Mauricio. Hello, Mauricio. How are you? All right. Hi, hi, teacher. Great. Yeah. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. So we have uh, also Daniel. Hello, Daniel. Hello, Oscar Humberto. Good evening. And Elizabeth, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Um, so I'm tired. <laughs> oh my God. I imagine because it is Friday, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Well, so it's already eight o'clock. So we're going to wait only for one more minute until eight two, right? So I was ready to wait one. So we're going to wait for one more minute to see who else can join the class. I think we can start with the class for tonight. So let's see here, who else is coming? Let's see, let's see. In the meantime, I'm going to share that presentation. Okay. Let's see, William Giovanni, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Great, excellent. Good, good. Thank you for being here on time. Okay, let's see here. Who else, who else is coming? Okay. Right, let's see. Mr. Luis Humberto, good evening. David Mungia, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Okay, so it's already 8-2. Perfect. So, well, let's start the class for tonight, all right? Thank you, everybody, for being here. I truly appreciate your punctuality, right? Let's start with the class. Bienvenidos a todos. Empecemos con la clase. Gracias por su puntualidad. All right, so let's just go ahead and check what is the tongue twister for tonight, all right? You know, as every day, I um, like to uh, start the class with a tongue twister to see how you develop your pronunciation, right? And how good you can pronounce these words right here. So we have this phrase, which we are going to pronounce um, five times. Vamos a pronunciar esta frase cinco veces. All right, but let me show you how you can uh, pronounce it, right? So the first one right here, it's gonna be this one. Everybody, repeat with me. Red, say it. Red. Very Fire. good. Red. Leather. 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 Yellow. Yellow. Leather. Yellow. Leather. All right, excellent. So just to check this one, what's the meaning of leather, people? What is leather? What do you think? Uh -huh. Yes, yes, yes. What is it? What is it? I heard somebody there. Leather. Uh -huh, thank you. All right. One more time, please. Leather. Thank you. All right. So you see it's leather. And what is it? Do you know it? Yes or no? No? No. All right. No problem. Le leather means cuero. Pero, sorry. So let's hit this one right here. 
There you go, excellent. So that's what we're going to be reading this one. Red leather, yellow leather. 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 All right, so you think you can make it? All right. So let's see. I will give you like two minutes so you can practice. All right, and then I will select some volunteers who can help me repeating that tongue twister again, all right? Okay, practice right now. Practice, 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 practice. So what is you practicing, all right? So red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. All right, come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Let's practice, 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 practice. Come on. Mm -hmm. I can see some volunteers from here. Mm -hmm. mm, what happens, Maria? <laughs> All right, possible volunteer, Anna, Mauricio, Erling, William, Nancy, Marta. All right, excellent. Oh, you will be the first volunteer, uh, Giovanni, yes? Yes, teacher. Excellent, that's the attitude, all right? Thank you. Let's start right now, go okay. ahead, friend. Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. Excellent. That was actually very good. We just need to remember, Mr. Laines, to pronounce the R like in English, porque se escuchó como red, esa R de español. All right. And remember, red. like red. 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 Muy bien. Red leather, yellow leather. Repeat it. Red leather, yellow leather. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. That was actually super, super nice. Thank you, my friend. You did it good, good, good. Do we have a volunteer? Another volunteer? Yes, 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 yes. No volunteers? Okay, William, it's your opportunity to select the next volunteer. <laughs> oh, I got a volunteer, hey, William, early. Ah. Casi, William, casi. All right, so thank you. All right, Erling, tell me. Okay, uh, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. Okay, thank you very much. That was actually nice, right? <laughs> you did a very good job. I like it, all right? And good pronunciation of the letter R, all right? Good, good, good. Thank you. All right, so... Let's see, let's see. Thank you. Next volunteer. Next volunteer, volunteer. Okay, let's see. Oh, well. Erlin, it's your opportunity to select the next volunteer. Okay, let me see. Abner. Oh my God. I guess you need to select a different person because Abner was not paying attention. <laughs> hola, 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 hola. Teacher, hello. Hello. Don't worry, my friend. Le vamos a dar un minuto para que ahí practique. Then we will select you. Okay. All right, so. All right, early, different uh, person. Let me see, let me see. Maria. Ah, Maria. Hello, hello. Okay. Okay, red, red, leader, yellow, leader, red, leader, yellow, leader, red, leader, yellow, leader, red, leader, yellow, leader, red, leader, yellow, leader. All right, excellent. So, but just remember, right, that the word is leather, 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 leather. Okay, leather. Yes, one more time, please. You can do it. Okay. Red, I'm oh, sorry. Red, leather, leather, right? Leather. No, leather, leather, leather. Leather. Mm -hmm. Red, leather, yellow, leather. 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 Excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So that was nice, 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 nice. All right. So thank you for correcting that. All right, thank you. Let's see. Um, Maria, select another person. 
Marta Marisol. Hello, Marta. Hello, teacher. How are you? Okay. Red leather, yellow leather. 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 Oh, very good. I like it. Amazing, amazing. That was actually super good. Thank you for participating, Marta. Oh, we have another volunteer, which is Mr. Rano. Hello, sir. Okay, teacher. Go ahead, please. Red, okay. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow red. Red leather, yellow red. Please, leather. Sorry. Red no leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow red. Sorry. <laughs> all right. One more time. <laughs> all right. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Remember red leather, yellow leather. All right. So come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Try one more time. Try one more time. Okay. okay. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow le leather. All right. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for. Uh, trying again, right? I know it was difficult the first time, but then you repeat it again and it was way better. Good job. Very good job. All right. So let's see here. And now let's just continue with the next person. Another volunteer. Hello, hello. Another volunteer. Oh, hello, Abner. Hi again. Okay. Okay. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow red leather. Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red le leather, yellow leather. All right, excellent, all right. Al final como que se traba un poco la lengua, right? So, very yeah. good. Yeah. But thank you, thank you for trying, all right? You did it good as well. Porque te rijo, porque te rijo. All right, oops, there you go. Let's just continue with this one, all right? Anybody else here wants to participate? Another volunteer? Mm -hmm. And where is Anna Louis and Elizabeth? Uh -huh. Hello, Anna Elizabeth. Hello. Teacher. Okay. Okay. Red leather, yellow leather. 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 There you go. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for trying. All right. So who's next? Oh, Nancy. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Hello, Nancy. Hello. This is easy for you, Nancy. Come on. Mm, <laughs> I, okay. Red leather, yellow leather. 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 Oh my God, that was easy for you and super good. You see, you did it good, 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 good. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Who's missing? Who's missing? Oh, I can see Carla is here. Hello, Carlita. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. All right. Después va Irma. All right. So let's see. Tell me, Carlita. Go ahead. Okay. Um. Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. Oh my God, that was actually very, very good. All right. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that one. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for participating, everybody. Uh huh. Where is Irma? Irma, Irma. Mm. Atrapamos. All right. So let's see. Don't worry. Fine, fine, fine. Anybody else who's missing? Let's see. Sonia. Hello, Sonia. Good evening. Mm -hmm. Oh, my goodness. Hello, Madra. Vamos. Quiero ver quién más. Mr. Gonzalez. Smooth. He doesn't say oyente tonight. Are you there? <laughs> All right, no problem. 
So let's see. Let's actually continue with the next part here. Oops, sorry. Let's continue with the next part here, all right? Okay, so tonight we are going to actually talk about the new topic. We are going to start the last unit, all right, which is the unit number four. All right, and uh, we are going to talk about something different here, all right? So did you see, uh, do you see a new screen, people? Yes or no? No. 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 Just, no. Uh, the no. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. No problem. Let me see here. My computer it's wants to go on vacation. All right. Do you see it now? Yes. Yeah. Great. Excellent. Yes. So tonight we're going to talk about hotel services, right? The hotel services. So what is or what are hotel services, all right? So let me just help you reading this so you can get some vocabulary, all right? So it says right here that uh, hotel services, so hotel service means renting of rooms, all right? What's the meaning of renting here, people? Rentar. Alquilar. Alquilar or rentar, as you want to say it, right? So that's going to be like renting here of room, houses, or other lodging accommodations. What's the meaning of lodging, people? Do you know that one? Mm -hmm. Any idea? Or not? Just tell me so I can tell you. No. It means alojamiento. I'm gonna send it in the chat so you can see it. Lodging. All right, let's continue. Accommodations for a fee. What is a fee? Hmm? No, a fee is un cargo, un cobro. Tarifa. Cargo, tarifa. There you go. Cobro un cargo, una tarifa. All right. Including all services offered at the hotel, including, but not limited to, all right, business center services, all right, ese sería un, un eh, hotel service, un business center service, donde la gente se reúne a hablar de negocios, right, so in a hotel, um, message service, so you can see it here, all right, there are some hotels that they have a spa, all right, so swimming pool, all right, so the swimming pool. ¿Qué es una swimming pool, people? Una piscina. Una piscina, very piscina good. Para... All right, exactly, right? Laundry services. ¿Qué sería laundry services? Eh, servicio de lavado. Servicio de lavandería. De lavandería, exactly. All right, so you can have your uh, clothes clean, depending on how many days you're going to be there. All right, so we have all those things, all those words right there tonight. All right, so... Uh, weather. What is weather, people? Clima. Excuse me? Clima? Uh, casi. All right. So the word. Tiempo. Clima lleva una letra A, mm -hmm. pero esta no. Eso significa ya sea. Ah, uh, ya sea. Uh -huh. Like that one. Ya sea pagado por el, por el, el huésped en el hotel o el visitante del hotel. All right, so that's actually what it says right here. So hotel service means renting of rooms, houses, or other lodging accommodations for a fee, including all services offered at the hotel, including, but not limited to, business center services, massage service, swimming pools fees, laundry services, whether paid by the guest of the hotel or a visitor to the hotel. All right, excellent. So, can someone help me to read this one? All right. Who's going to be my volunteer? Me, teacher. All right, Erling, thank you very much. Go ahead, please. Uh, just let me. Okay. Uh, what are hotel service? Yes. Uh, hotel service means renting of rooms, houses, or other lodging. Lodging, yes. 
accommodation Correct. for a fee, including all service offered at the hotel, including but no limited to business center service, massage, massage service, service swimming yes. pool fees, laundry service, etc. Uh, whether paid by a guest of the hotel or a visitor to the hotel. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. All right. So just a uh, that was almost perfect. All right. Just remember when you pronounce the word etc. All right. So you are going to use uh, the pronunciation de la t de etc. Sería como una r de Spanish. Entonces quedaría como etc. Repeat it. Etc. Right. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. All right. So uh, that's it. Thank you, my friend. That's actually correct. Uh, I need another volunteer, please, for helping me to read this. Who's going to be my next volunteer? Mm, Anna. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see. No, just kidding. Another person who wants to read? Okay. Oh, Anna, you will read? Yes. Okay, thank you. Hotel service means renting of rooms house or other lodging accommodation for a fee including all service offered at the hotel including but not limited to business center service massage is a so massage no. service swimming pool swimming pool fee laundry service etc with a with a Pay by a guest of the hotel or a visitor to the hotel. Visitor to the hotel. Very good job. Excellent. Thank you. Anna, you were doing a very good job on this one. All right. So we are going to uh, finish this activity with one more person who help us to read again. All right. So who wants to be my last volunteer for this uh, paragraph reading? All right. One volunteer more. All right. Who is it? Me, teacher. Thank you, Maria. Whenever okay. What are, what are hotel services? Hotel services means renting of rooms, house, or other loading accommodation mm -hmm. for a fee, including our service offered at the hotel, including but not limited to business center services. Massage service, swimming pool, fits, laundry service, etc. Where paid by guests of the hotel or visit, visitor to hotel. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. You were doing a fantastic job on this one. Thank you, everybody. Before we move to the next activity, do you have questions about any other word, vocabulary that you don't understand? Any questions about vocabulary? Alguna pregunta de vocabulary? Yes or Richard, no? ¿cómo, ¿Cómo es lo de acomodación o cómo es? ¿Cómo es ahí? La pronunciación. Sí. Sería accommodation. Así, mira. Ok. Can you repeat it? Accommodation. Shen. Shen, 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 shen. Shen, accommodation. accommodation. There you go, exactly. Así tal cual. Very good job. Thank you. Any other word? No? All right, no problem. So let's just continue with this one right here. Okay, excellent. So then let me show you here some vocabulary about the hotel services. All right, and you know, vocabulary in general. So obviously the main thing here is the hotel. All right, so that's actually how to say, please don't say hotel o algo por el estilo, right? So en ese caso la T sigue quedando como T. So you said hotel, everybody hotel. 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 Exactly, right? So now let's just go here when we have the first next to hotel. When we go this one right here and we can say front desk. Repeat it, front desk. Front desk. Front, front desk. 
There you go. Excellent. So, what is the front desk, people? Mostrador. Mm, casi, casi. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo sería? Lo llamamos de otra forma. Uh -huh. What is it? Escritorio. Escritorio sería solo desk. Uh -huh. And what about the rest? Recepción. Reception, correct. Algo parecido como la recepcionista en Spanish, right? Lo más parecido. All right, so you got it? Yes? All right, excellent. So like this one. There you go. So in, what is the front desk, people? Mostrador. The reception. The reception. Reception. All right. Reception. Sure, it is the same for the lobby. Uh, no, the lobby is actually something different. Ya lo voy a explicar. De hecho, está después. All right, so ahorita lo explico. Luego tenemos aquí el lobby. Repeat, lobby. Lobby. Lobby, lobby, lobby. lobby, lobby. All right, how do you translate the lobby? El lobby sí está frente a la recepción, pero cuando lo traducimos se dice vestíbulo. All right, so, ¿y qué es el vestíbulo? Uh -huh. Es básicamente una, digamos, sala. En, el, en, en la recepción, donde la gente espera, you know, for like anything they need from the hotel. All right. Entonces, la diferencia del front desk y el lobby sería que el front desk es exclusively, exclusively sorry, the reception, right? Donde está la recepcionista recibiendo los clientes. Y el lobby, la sala donde esperan los clientes en entrada del hotel. All right. Is that clear? Yes. Yes or no? Questions? No. No questions? No? Okay, no problem. Let's just go for this one right here. How do you pronounce this word? Hello? Any idea? Concierge. Concierge? Concierge. Oh my goodness, that was correct. Thank you, Erlin. So one more time, please. Concierge. Concierge, right? Exactly. Concierge, right? And what is that, people? Mm -hmm. It's a como el conserje. El conserje, right? So it's just basically uh, the person in charge of the hotel of cleaning or helping in the customers with anything they need. All right. So, um, you know, basically, it's an employee of hotel that helps with whatever situation that you need. All right, so no solamente para las paletas, sino que like, we can be like getting you some food, cleaning your room, etc. right? So then, everybody here, room service, room service. Room, room service. service. <laughs> Excellent, all right. So what is a room service, people? Servicio de cuarto. Servicio de cuarto, right? So you pick up the phone and say like, hello, I want a hamburger. And then they go with the hamburger there. Easy, good job. Then we have this one right here. Everybody, elevator, elevator. 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 elevator, exactly, right? So that now it could look like something that the hotels are supposed to have. However, sometimes, you know, like the, especially the old hotels or um, there are hotels in some places that they don't have an elevator, right? Good, excellent, thank you. Uh, what is the elevator, people? El elevador o el ascensor, exactly, right? Very good, excellent. Let's continue with the next one right here. Everybody, wake up call. Repeat, wake up call. Wake up call. Wake up call. All right, excellent. So what is the wake up call? Es como una llamada para que lo despierten a uno. Una alarma. That is correct. Una llamada de alarma, if you want to say it like that, all right? So usted le dice la receptionist, al front desk. Mire, quiero que me hablen a las... 7 de la mañana, tomorrow, y ahí le van a estar llamando hasta que se despierte y conteste. All right, so, but that's it, right? Pero una vez usted contesta, ya está hecha la llamada. Si se vuelve a dormir, ya la regó. All right, so, let's see. Let's continue with this one right here. The next one right here, everybody. Tip, repeat, tip. Tip. All right, excellent, right? What is a tip, people? Uh -huh. No es un consejo. consejo. <laughs> All right. Exactly, right? No, no es un consejo. Como, let me give you a tip, right? Not a recommendation. El tip is just like money. Money that you give 
to the front desk or to an employee, all right, after they have provided you with the service. For example, uh, exactly, in a restaurant, we need we normally give tip to the waitress or the waiters, right? Es una propina, el tip. Mm -hmm. Good, 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 good. ¿Cuál ha sido la propina más cara que han dado people? What is like the most expensive tip you have given? A dollar, two dollars, five dollars, ten dollars. La que venía en el ticket, ya. Yeah. All right, so good. Seven dollars. Yes. Exactly, like seven dollars, imagine. Si, sí, la que venía en el ticket, ni modo, right? So good. There you go. Excellent. So everybody here, Bellman, Bellman. 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 Bellman, all right? Bellman. Bellman, people. No es el nombre de campana, people, please. All right, so what is it? Los botones que le dicen. Los botones. Creo. El chompiras, very good. There you go. So I like that one. Thank you so much. This is the person who helps you to um to carry your baggage or your luggage to the room, right? El and botones. Course, el, excuse me. El botones. Correct. 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 All right. And after this person has helped you, you need to give a tip. All right. So yes, you need to give a tip. Then everybody here, this one. Repeat it with me. Check in. Repeat it. Check in. Check in. Check in. Very good. And what is the meaning of check in, people? La inscripción al, al hotel. No sé cómo mm -hmm. se dice. El registro. You know, registro. El registro en el hotel. Exactly. That is correct. Very good job. Excellent. So then let's continue with the next one. All right. Everybody. Housekeeper. Repeat it. Housekeeper. Housekeeper. There you go. Excellent. So what is the housekeeper here? Sería como la No, I wouldn't say ama de casa, but that's a different. Yes, housewife. All right. So pero like it's a different thing. What is a housekeeper? Es la que hace la limpieza. <laughs> yeah, no the housekeeper. La you know, mucama. Exactly. You know, oh, le no. llaman la, 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 sí, tal, tal vez el traductor te lo puede decir como la like, ama de casa por las activities that the person does, all right, pero por las actividades, right, pero la sería como el ama de llaves, la famosa ama de llaves, you know, y le dicen el ama de llaves porque es the lady tiene las llaves like the whole rooms in the hotel, right, and she enters to the rooms, to clean the, the rooms, right? Then we go for this one right here, everybody. Key card, pretty key card. Key card. card. Very good, excellent. So what is the key card? Mm -hmm. Tarjeta de llaves. That is correct. Suena como tarjeta de llaves, si la traducimos literal, all right, so, but sería la tarjeta de acceso. Exactly, exactly. All right, so good, 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 good. So let's say this one right here, all right? And let's just go ahead and continue with this one. Questions about the vocabulary, people? No? Okay, excellent. So let's just continue then with the next activity here. And uh, what's this one? So we have now two questions that we are going to answer here, all right? It's time for you to practice talking and speaking. All right, so everybody, question number one, please repeat it after me. Do you usually go on business trips? Repeat it. Do you usually go on business trips? All right, excellent. Remember that there are two possible answers for this question. So I let the first question, the first answer will be, yes, I do, or no, I don't, all right? And then let's see, can you mention three hotel services? Repeat it. Huh? Repeat the question, please. Can you mention three hotel services? Repeat it. Can, can, you, can you mention, mention three, hotel, three services? hotel services? Thank you very much. All right. So, and then you mentioned some of the services you were actually um, practicing before. Let's see. Maria. Hello, Maria. Mm. Hello, teacher. All right, Maria, ask the questions to me. All okay, right. do you usually go to business trips? 
Uh, no, I don't. Next question. Okay, can you mention three hotel services? Yes, uh, the bellboy, the housekeeper, and the room service. And that's it, right? Eso es todo lo que tú tienes que responder. Very good, excellent. Thank you, Maria. Ahora se la voy a regresar a usted las questions. All right, so let's see. Maria, do you usually go on business trips? No, I don't. Can you mention three hotel services? Uh, Checking in. Checking. House, check in. Mm -hmm. Housekeepers. Yeah. And Belmont. And? Belmont. Belmont. Yes, that is correct. All right. Very good. Thank you, Maria. Now you can select another person. Okay. Um, Luis Humberto Gonzalez. Okay. Let's see if Luis Humberto is online. He is here, but might be maybe just listening tonight. You should select another person, Maria, please. Mauricio Antonio. Thank you. Good. Mauricio, do you usually go on business trips? No, I don't. All right. Can you mention three hotel services? Um, mm -hmm. Sorry, teacher. Uh huh. What happened? Mauricio, hello. Hello, teacher. Yes. Uh, what happens with the? Can you mention three hotel services? It's from the vocabulary that we were studying. Acabamos de anotar. Lobby, elevator, room service. For example. Oh. So? Lo one more time, please repeat. Um, the question or like this one? Aquí están, ve? Question. Can you mention three hotel services? Aquí los tienen Sorry. pantalla, Mauricio. All right, excellent. ¿Quién le puede dar a, a Mauricio para decir los three hotel services, people? Okay, go ahead, Erling. Okay, uh, the three services, the three hotel services mm -hmm. uh, can be wake up call, mm -hmm. the housekeeper, mm -hmm. and it could be the swimming pool. The swimming pool could be as well as service, but hay hoteles okay. que no tienen pool, right? So, así que yes, absolutely, right? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Mauricio, and thank you, Erlene. All right, so let's see. Let's continue with the question right here, all right? So, let's see. Uh, now that we got this one, people, it's time for you to practice this, um, this paragraph, I mean, this dialogue here. So we can actually go ahead and verify this one, all right? So vamos a tener una doble actividad aquí. Y es la primera actividad que vamos a hacer. 
en los breakout rooms. ¿Cuál es la actividad? Vamos a repasar este diálogo que tenemos aquí para poder responder también las preguntas que tenemos acá. All right. Entonces, um, let's say this one. Let me help you with the pronunciation and vocabulary here. And before I send you to the breakout rooms, it says, for example, Mark's travel agency. How can I help you? Repeat, everybody. Mark's, Mark's travel, travel agency. agency. How can I help you? How can I help you? All right, exactly. Then, good morning. I need a reservation. Repeat it. Good morning. Good morning. I, I need, need a reservation. reservation. Um, I need a reservation for a single room. Repeat it. For a, a single, single room. room. Okay. For a single room. Vocabulary. What is, for example, single room? Uh, excuse me habitación para una persona exactly all right or what we call here una habitación sencilla could be es lo mismo. <laughs> <laughs> una habitación de soltero all right okay fine and otro nombre all right so then uh, we go to the next one all right so what else what else it says right here i'm going to travel to costa rica repeat it I'm going to travel to Costa Rica. All right, excellent. So let's see this one. Next one, right here. Sure, pretty sure. Sure. May I have your name, please? May I have your name, please? Thank you very much. Excellent. So let's see. And now let's just go on this one. Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Repeat it. Of course, of course. I'm Rosa. I am Rosa Puentes. Rosa Puentes. There you go. Exactly. All right. So then let's see this one. Um, the, what is it? Sorry, it's like it's just like here. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry. Thank you, Mrs. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Repeat it. Thank you, Mr. Puentes. How long are you, you going, going to stay? stay? There you go. I'm going to stay three days. Repeat it. I'm, I'm going, going to, to stay, stay three, days. three days. Three days. Exactly. Right. Very good. So let's just continue right now here. Um, let's do this one. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Repeat it. Are you going, going to stay, stay in a smoking, smoking or a smoking room? There you go. Exactly. All right. So let's do this one here. And what is the difference between a smoking and non-smoking room, people? The habitación de fumar o de no fumar. Exactly. Habitación de fumar o de no fumar. All right. Very good. Excellent. So let's say this one right here. And then uh, let's just continue with the next one. It says here, are you going to need the shuttle service? Repeat it. Excellent. So what is the shuttle service here, people? Do you know that one? El shuttle service es un servicio de transporte. All right. Normalmente de un hotel al aeropuerto y viceversa. All right. This is like shuttle service, transportation. All right. Meaning here. All right. Excellent. Questions? Sí, teacher. And are you going to need, ¿cómo se dice? The shuttle. 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 All right. It will be like this one. Shuttle. I see. Shuttle. Repeat it. Okay. Total. Exactly like that. Good job. All right. Excellent. So, all right. Excellent. So this is exactly what you are going to be reading to. Remember to give the intonation, right? Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. 
Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. All right. And that's basically uh, like the whole paragraph right there. All right, eh, ready to go to the breakout rooms, people. Remember to practice para poder responder también las preguntas. Ya les voy a mandar el, el, en el grupo de WhatsApp los, las fotos, la captura de este párrafo y de las preguntas que hay que responder. All right. The request has been sent, people. Please join the breakout rooms right now, please. I'm sending the information to the group right now so you can see it. Okay, so let's see. Where is it? Where are you guys? Okay, here you are. There you go. Sending this to the group right now. And this one. All right, everybody here uh, having difficulties to join the groups? No? All right. Let's see. Okay. 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 Um, Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. Mm -hmm. I'm Rosa Fuentes. Thank you, Miss Fuentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Okay, are you going to need the, the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, va, voy al revés. Okay. Teacher, no la había visto. Okay, espérame. Esta cosita se me mueve. Vaya, voy. Okay. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April for, uh, 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mrs. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. 
Are you going to need the tour service? Yes, please. Okay. Yeah, All right. Ready. Nancy, remember, no sé si yo cometí el error ahí, pero este, okay. eh, en el MIS, es MIS, como dice nada más, MS, right? MS. Ah, okay, es MIS. Okay. Cuando okay. es MRS, ahí sí es MIS. Es MIS. Ok. Uh -huh. Porque ella es single. Uh -huh. Ok. Entiendo que sí, por eso, ¿verdad, Ticha? Eh, sí, porque le, el, la, la, las le, letras M y S eh, significan la abreviación para Miss, que es soltera, ah, okay. ¿verdad? Right? Y si tuviera la, la abreviación MRS, pues sería la abreviación para señora. Ajá. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Es Miss, Missis, perdón. Okay. Missis, mm, ok. All right. Ok. Thank you. Vaya, right. hoy las preguntas... Uh -huh. Rosa needs a double room. False. Rosa is going to stay for three days. True. True. Rosa is go going to stay in a smoking room. False. Yes, false. Teacher, yo tengo una, una duda con esta última. Dígame. Dice, Rosa is going to rent a car at the airport. Porque uh -huh. ella está pidiendo el... el el shuttle service uh -huh. y es lo mismo que rentar un carro o, o no parte es distinto no ajá porque rentar un carro pues tú te llevas el carro donde tú quieres right whatever you want ah, okay. y el shuttle service nada más es un servicio entre el hotel y el aeropuerto como de taxi <risa> digámoslo así pero solo uno es como un solo viaje no es que tú vas a estar donde quieras con él right ah, ok ok entiendo ah uh -huh. pues sí entonces sería false false uh -huh. alright sí. Yes. Estamos ready. <laughs> all right, excellent. Va, good. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'll practice. Practice one more time, all right? Mientras yo este, reviso otros groups, all right? Okay. Excellent. Okay. Practiquen la intonation para que suenen así como la like, Hi, thank you for calling this one. How can I help you today? Ah, like that. Oh, <laughs> excellent. Call center, ya, exactly. Exactly. Me están preparando para el call center. Usted. Yes. yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll be back. I'll be back. Uh, okay. Okay. Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have, I have your name? Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mr. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Uh, non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the total service? Yes, please. Okay, good job, ladies. Okay. All right. So just remember something here quickly, right? Están haciendo un buen trabajo with the pronunciation, pero me gustaría que trabajara un poquito más la entonación. ¿A qué se refiere con la intonation? All right. Por ejemplo, en lugar de que me digan, Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? All right. Que le pongamos un poquito más la intonation, like, Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? How can I help you? How can I help you? Right? Okay. Okay. How can I help you? Okay, así un poquito más. Más rápido. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? All right, excellent. La voy a escuchar individual. Vamos primero con Ana y luego María. All right? Okay. Okay. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Muy bien, María. Mark Travel Agency, how can I help you? Very good, ya ve que si pueden, right? So, y yeah, después, good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on... Cerra la ventana, Andrés. All right, la ventana. All right, so, good, good, good. So, let's see. All right, understand? Right. Cada vez que hay un punto es, por ejemplo, good morning, una pequeña pausa. I Ajá. need a reservation for... Me quito a la imagen. Right. Eh, pero le quería bajar volumen y se me fue. All right. Pero, pero. There you go. No la encuentro. Arriba de eso está. Ay, 
<risa> tengo dos niños aquí que molestan. Oh, Mami, deja de decir. Ahí está. Ahí está. Vaya por su vida. Está peleando, mira. All right, thank you. All right, thank you, thank you. Okay. So let's see here, this one right here. Veamos. Por ejemplo, they say, good morning. Hacemos una pausa. I need a reservation for a single room. Otra vez la pequeña pausa. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Right. Una vez más, una vez más. Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. All right, Maria. Okay, good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. All right, excellent. Y así vamos a ir leyendo. La siguiente es una pregunta. Remember que cada vez que hay una pregunta, ah, es yeah. una con al final, right? Like, sure. Okay. May I have your name, please? Y ahí va. All right. Sigamos practicing. What is the people? Que ya les queda poco tiempo y les hace falta las preguntas. All right, so. Ya la hice. Nice. So, all right, solo practice entonces. All right. I'll be back, I'll be back. April. Sure, my uh, how do you please? Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mr. Puentes. How old you? How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or no smoking room? None smoking, please. Are you going to need the sure service? Yes, please. Me toca Mauricio. Teacher, una pregunta. Tenemos yes. duda en, res en reservación. ¿Cómo es res reserva? Reservation. <risa> reservation. Recuerden lo que les decía la vez pasada, que cada vez que ustedes tengan ese sonido final que termina en Sean, se pronuncia como Shen, así. Reservation. Ajá. Reservation. Sí, reservation. Reservation. Cuidado con esa R, porque me suena a R de español. Y tiene que ser así como un gringo que quiere comer, así, esa R. Reservation. Exactly. Thank you very much. Reservation. Y por ahí no sé quién, quién pronunció cuando entré al room, a quién estaba pronunciando abril. Y no es April, sino que es April. 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 All right, April. excelente. ¿Ya tienen las preguntas contestadas? Yes. Sí. Excelente, excelente, excelente. All right. Very good. Entonces vamos a ir ya al main room, people. Regresemos, please. Okay. Hey, hello, hello, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Ya tenemos ahí un volunteers. Volunteers, volunteers. Yes, or yes. Okay, excellent. So, uh, guys, do I have a volunteer to, pr to, to practice this? Erling, Erling and Nancy, right? Thank I'm you. a teacher. I'm already. Excellent, excellent. With all the powers. That's the attitude, all right? With the power. Very good, very good. Very good. Let's continue. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, Mars Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shower service? Yes, please. Oh my God, that was actually very, very good. I liked it. So that was super nice. You did it super good. Nice intonation, nice pronunciation. All right. So that was super nice. Congratulations. I liked it. I like it. Thank you. And thank you for being the volunteer. Thank you. Right. Thank very you, good job. 
And let's see, let's see. What about another volunteer? Mm -hmm. Hello, hello. More volunteers here? Me, teacher. Thank you, Maria. So it will be Maria and Anna, right? Yes. Okay, perfect. Go ahead, please, girls. Okay. Hello. Mark Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rodriguez. Thank you, Mr. Puente. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay for two days. Are you going to stay in a smoking room or in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. All right, excellent. Thank you very much. All right, so. Había un, un poquito de delay aquí, así como like, what happens, right? So, thank you, thank you, girls. That was actually super good. You were doing a fantastic job as well, all right? Gracias por aplicar lo que les corregí en el room, all right? So, that was actually very good. Thank you. You did a good job. All right. Thank, thank you. you. Next, next, next. Mm -hmm. A ver, volunteers. William, William, William y compañía. Igual, no tengo como muchos volunteers okay, ahora. O tu, tu <laughs> nice clase de los oyentes. What happens? <laughs> right, so, very good. Let's see. Go ahead. William, who are you going to work with? Porque hay mucha gente en ese room. ¿Con quién será? Marta. All right. Yo, teacher. <laughs> Excelente. Go ahead. Okay. Mark Traver Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I hide you your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mr. Fuentes. How, how, how long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. And you going to need the shared service? Yes, please. Thank you very much, All right? That was actually super good. Just remember, Mr. Laines, the pronunciation of, for example, agencia, no es agency, sino que pronunciamos la E, la A, perdón, como la E in, in, in Spanish, right? Agency. Repeat. Agency. Exactly. Y remember, agency. right? Okay. Shoro. <laughs> okay, teacher. Yes. Shoro. <laughs> exactly. Thank you very much. All right, and where is Mauricio? Where, 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 where? I don't see Mauricio here. Where, 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 where? Uh, Mauricio, Mauricio? Hello, Mauricio. Mm -hmm. Disappear, Mauricio, tonight. All right, no problem. Creo que estamos, esos somos todos los volunteers de ahora, right? Thank, thank you guys for helping me. All right, very good. Now we are going to continue here. Oh, Alexa. Hello, Alexa. Hello, teacher. Eh, me gustaría participar, solo que yo no estuve en los grupos porque hasta ahorita voy llegando a la casa. Okay. Solo venía escuchando. No problem. Hey, guys, who can help eh, Alexa? ¿Quién puede ayudar a Alexa? Ser el agent para que sea Rose. Uh -huh. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Me, teacher. Thank you, Maria. So you are the agent, all right? Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Go ahead. Okay. Mars Travel Agency, how can I help you? 
Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April uh, 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need the shooter services? Yes, please. Thank you, girls. You were doing a very good job. And thank you, Maria, for helping um, Alexa, right? And thank you, Alexa, for being the volunteer, all right? Okay, thank you, Maria. Excellent. You're welcome. So we can continue now here with this one. All right, this one is very simple. So now tell me, who can tell me the answer for this one, all right? Um, it says, number one, everybody, Rosa needs a double room. True or false? False. 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 What was the type of room that uh, Rosa asked for? Single, single room. Single room. Exactly, right? That was a single room. So this is completely false. Very good. Uh, what about number two? Rosa is going to stay for three days. True. 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 True, exactly, right? So she's gonna be for three days there. Excellent. All right, what about number three? Rosa, it's going to stay in a smoking room. False. False, yes. What was the room? No, a smoking no, room. Smoking. No smoking, exactly, thank you. All right, what about um, number four? Rosa is going to rent a car at the airport. True or false? False. 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 All right. false. Why? Because she yes. needs a shuttle service. Because she needs shuttle services. All right, that is absolutely correct. So this is actually false as well. All right, so thank you. Thank you, you were doing a very good job. Practicing the pronunciation and also paying attention and understanding, all right? So good job, everybody. Thank you. So let's see this one here. And let's see what happens in the next activity. All right, so now tenemos estas dos words here que nos va a, um, just to check this one. Veamos, por aquí tengo un chat, que dice aquí? All right. Present this amount. <laughs> all right. So, all right. Vaya, Mauricio. Lo voy a tomar desde allá para la asistencia. All right. So, let's see. Thank you. Uh, let's continue with this one. All right. It says um, accommodation. Everybody, accommodation. 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 Yeah, otra palabra es amenities. Repeat it. Amenities. Amenities. Exactly, right? Amenities. All right, excellent. So, the amenities. There you go. What's this one right here? What are some amenities? Well, pretty much almost accommodation, right? Accommodation is a place, such a room in a hotel, where travelers can sleep and find other services. So, basically, um, una accommodation it will be just like a room, you know, basically, un hotel. Y las amenities son como the features or los benefits que el hotel te ofrece. Por ejemplo, uh, pool, the gym, mini bar, jacuzzi, o los hotel services que acabamos de ver. Esa es la diferencia entre accommodation and uh, amenities, all right? Las accommodations son the rooms, and the amenities, lo que hay en el hotel, los beneficios adicionales, right? For example, room service, uh, laundry service, wake up call, uh, etc. Right? Is that clear? Yes. 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 Excellent. Thank you very much. Here. All right. Ahora tenemos estas questions here. Mira, tenemos estas pequeñas questions that we're going to um, answer. Y te preguntarás de dónde vamos a responder estas questions. Las vamos a responder en una, there you go, here, vamos a ver un pequeño video de una reservation, 
All right. Así que let's just go ahead and check this one. Primero veamos here cómo, eh, qué significa cada una de las preguntas para que no quede duda. All right. So, and we got this one there. For example, they say the first one. What is the customer's name? Repeat, everybody. What is the customer's name? There you go. Excellent. So, do you understand? That was easy, or not? What is it? Okay. Exactly. Thank you very much. All right. So then we go for this one, number two. How did the customer book the reservation? Mira que tenemos una palabra aquí nueva. All right. So what is this one right here? It's going to be this one. Everybody here, book. All right. What is book? Cuaderno, libro. Un libro. You know what? Esa traducción es correcta. But... Eh, en este contexto de hoteles significa reservar. Right, reserve. All right. How did the customer book the reservation? All right. Entonces ahí sería cómo el cliente hizo o reservó para la valga la redundancia la reservación. All right. So there you go on this one. ¿Qué significa book, people? What's the meaning of book? Reservar. Thank you. All right, let's go for number three. What was the problem with the reservation? Uh, problem on the reservation? Exactly, all right. And then we go for the next one. Where is the customers? Where is the customer from? ¿Cómo se dice eso, people? Where is the customer from? And what's the meaning in Spanish? De donde es el cliente o algo así. Thank you, Alexa. That is correct. Um, what activity will the customer attend? All right. Aquí tenemos otra palabra que nos puede servir. Attend. What is attend? Mm -hmm. Hello. Mm -hmm. Es asistir. Asistir, asistir, no de ayudar, sino de ir a un lugar. All right. Let's see this one right here. Well, eh, preguntas acerca de las preguntas. Questions about the questions. No. No questions. No, teacher. Wow, good, excellent. Antes de empezar a ver el video, voy a pasar lista, my friends, verdad, para que estemos atentos ahí. Ya tuvimos el presente a Mr. Rano, así que no problem. <laughs> right, so, let's see this one. Veamos. Friday, 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 Friday. Oh, this is Friday here. All right, excellent. Okay, so let's see this one right here. It says Abner. It's there. All right. So, Alexa, Marcela. Pre present. Thank you. And Elizabeth. Present. Ana Luisa. Present, teacher. Hello, Ana. All right. So, Mr. Pardo. Not here to dine. All right. So, let's see. David Munguia. Yes, he's here. All right, uh, Neftali, not tonight. All right, Erlin, Irma, Jose Daniel. Present. Jose Daniel, not here tonight. All right, Present. Jose Francisco, ¿Quién era el último que me dijo eso? Jose Daniel. Sí, teacher. All right, thank you. All right, so let's see this one. Jose Francisco. Tonight. All right, excellent. Carla Milena. All right, so Kevin Cortez. Ahí estamos. All right, Luis Humberto. Get ready. Uh, Maria. Present teacher. Okay. Well, let's see. Maria. Mm, all right. Marta. Present teacher. 
Thank you. Mauricio Ruano. Yes, present, dijo. Present, teacher. All right, so, Katia. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Oscar Giovanni. Yes, all right. Oscar Humberto. Mm -hmm. Present, teacher. Raúl Mauricio. Thank you. Uh -huh. uh, not to die. All right. Eh, Sandra Yamilet. Present, teacher. Thank you. Sonia Maribel. Present, teacher. All right. Excellent. And William Giovanni. Present. Thank you very much. Bueno, los ausentes hasta ahorita. Mr. Pardo. Um, Neftalí, José Francisco y Raúl Mauricio. ¿Alguien que no haya mencionado? Teacher present, me había levantado. No worries, ya lo pusimos ahí como de que no. All right, so. There you go, excellent. Thank you, my friend. That was actually good, good, good. Y ahora, let's watch the video. All right. All right, let's see here. Vamos a poner el video ahorita mismo. Good morning. Welcome to the Transnational Hotel. What can I do for you? Good morning. My name is Tom Sanders. I have a reservation for a single room for three nights. All right, Mr. Sanders, let me pull up your reservation. I can't seem to find a record of your booking. Did you book the room directly through us or do you use a hotel reservation service or a travel agent? Well, I booked it directly through you. All um, right, excellent. So let's just go ahead and verify this one. We have a hotel reservation service or a travel agent. Well, I booked it directly. Okay, excellent. Mira, directly through you. Do you see that? Yes? Aquí, ve. All right. It says directly through you. What is the meaning of directly through you? Directo, por ejemplo, directamente. Directamente, directamente. Exactly. Directamente a través de ustedes. Puede ser en este caso porque se refiere al hotel. All right. All right, so yes. Entonces, eso significa through you, es a través de ti. All right, so very good job, excellent. So let's just continue. Directly through you. I've already also paid a deposit on the first night. I have a, a reservation number if that helps. Yeah, sure. Can I see that, please? Thank you. Oh, I see. Maybe there was a glitch with the booking scheme. All right, excellent. So take a look to this word right here that we have. Take a look, take a look. It's this one. Glitch. Everybody, glitch. Mm. Very good. What is a glitch? Como alguna falla. Yes, that is correct. Es una falla, right? Un error. En el, ¿qué sería aquí? Booking system. En el sistema de reserva. La reserva. There you go. El sistema de reservas. Very good job. So, una falla en el sistema de reservas. All right. So, let's just continue with the video. System. Well, we don't have any more single rooms available, with the exception of one adjoined room, but you would then be right next door to a family with children, which might get noisy. But that's not a problem. I can upgrade you to one of our business suites. They all Ooh, jacuzzi. Come with jacuzzi. Oh, that sounds nice. Uh, but how much more is that going to cost? That would, of course, be at no extra charge to you. All right, excellent. Take a look. Oh, that sounds nice. Uh, but how much more is that going to cost? That would. And it says right here, this one. Take a look. Take a look. It says here, no extra charge. All right. What is no extra charge, people? Mm -hmm. Cargo. Ningún cargo extra o ningún cargo adicional. Exacto. O sea, no va a pagar más. There you go. Excellent. Thank you. Of course, yet no extra charge to you. Oh, well, thank you. My pleasure. Uh, what about the wireless internet? Okay, excellent. So. Yeah. Oh, well, thank you. My pleasure. 
The wireless internet. Take a look, people. The wireless internet. What is the wireless internet? Mm -hmm. You know what is the word wireless? Yes or no? No, teacher. Internet inalámbrico. Inalámbrico, exactly, right? El internet inalámbrico, right? O lo que le llamamos nosotros comúnmente el Wi-Fi, right? So, yes, let's continue with this one. About the wireless internet. Oh, it's really easy. This is your access code and instructions on how to use it. If you have any problems, feel free to call the front desk. Oh, remember this one? What was the front desk? Uh-huh. Llame recepción. Exactly. Llame recepción. Very good. Yes. And this is a list of all the hotel amenities. Okay. And then we have another word that we checked before. All right. The hotel amenities. What is the hotel amenities? Yeah, son todos los servicios del hotel. Exactly. Right. ¿Y qué servicios le muestra ahorita ahí eh, la señorita? Ignacio, piscina, pool. la piscina, pero qué, o sea, la, la piscina es pool, ajá, pero qué es indoor, what is indoor? Uh -huh. Es como eh, interior, interior, ¿verdad? interior, all right, so, es decir, la piscina que está bajo techo, piscina interior, ajá. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, hay hoteles en ciudades eh, que cuando neva, por ejemplo, ciudades como New York o Washington eh, o DC, right? So, cuando cae mucha nieve, la gente queda a las piscinas y obviamente la piscina está bajo techo y con una temperatura de acuerdo para que ellos se puedan eh, bañar. Son algunos servicios de hoteles. All right. Good. Let's continue here. Like the gym in the indoor pool. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Has the valet already taken your car or will you be needing a parking pass? Oh, I don't have a car. I took a taxi direct from the airport. Oh, all right. Could I have some form of ID, please? And could you just fill out this? All right, excellent. So take a look at this one. Esto ya lo hemos visto también. All right, and it's this word. Vamos a ver si do you remember this one. What is? Llenar. Mm, Llenar, muy bien. Llenar como el formulario, right? El formulario de registro. Form. Thank you. Uh, here's my driver's license. Thank you. Oh, you're from San Francisco. Yeah. Oh, you're from San Francisco. Muy so bien. I'm all the way from the West Coast. I hope you had a good trip. Yes, I did. Thank you. The flight was long, but it was smooth and I slept almost the whole way. Oh, and is this your first time in the Big Apple? What is the Big Apple, people? It was long, but it was smooth and I slept almost, almost the whole way. Oh, La Gran Manzana. Uh -huh. What is it? New York. New York. No, no me voy a decir que la saca mil, right? So, ese es New York. Okay. So, the New York, New York. Exactly. Is this your first time in the Big Apple? Yes, it is. I have a business conference to attend. Oh, look. Is this your first time in the Big Apple? Yes, it is. All right. So, take a look at this one right here. It will be this one right here. A business conference to attend. Attend, attend. Can you get attend? Assistir. All right. Entonces, ese señor va para una? Una conferencia de negocios. There you go, exactly. I have a business conference to attend, but I'm looking forward to getting some sightseeing done as well. Okay, mira, tenemos otra palabra nueva aquí. Take a look at this one. Everybody sightseeing. Repeat it, sightseeing. Sightseeing. There we go. Excellent. And what is sightseeing? Como turismo, teacher. Yes, turistear, de hecho, right? Como andar ahí por la ciudad, caminando, tomando fotos, you know, eh, etc. right? So, turistear. Well, I'd be more than happy to give you some sightseeing tips if you need any. Thank you. All right. I've got you all checked into your room. This is your room key. You're in room 653. Just take the elevator on the right up to the sixth floor. 
When you get off the elevator, turn right. Your room is at the end of the corridor on the left-hand side. All right, excellent. Ya mostré una expresión que me gustaría enseñarte. And it's this one. Left hand side. Do you see it? What is left hand side? Which is this one, you see? Left. Mano izquierda. Hand side. Yes, a mano izquierda. Y a mano derecha sería? Right. Huh? Right. Right hand side. Exactly. Mano derecha, mano izquierda. Very good. Excellent. Just leave your suitcase here and the bellboy will bring it up. Oh, okay. Aquí le llaman de otra manera, mira, pero es parecido. All right. What was this one? Mm -hmm. Do you remember that? Yes or no? Botones. El botón es solo que nosotros lo habíamos aprendido como bellman. All right. Y este es el bellboy. Aquel era el hombre campana. Este es el chico campana. All right. So. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Great. Well, thank you very much. If you need anything, please feel free to dial the front desk. All right. Excellent. Con eso terminamos. What's this one right here? Dial. Mm -hmm. What is it, people? What is dial? Que tenga un buen día. Uh, no, dial means marcar, es decir, de un teléfono, right? So, marcar. Okay. Marcarle la recepción. All right, excellent. Thank you, guys. All right, all right. So, let's see this one right here. What are we going to do right now? So. Teacher. Yes. Eh, feel free, que era? Oh, como siéntete libre de. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Por eso decía, feel free to dial. Feel free to. Feel free to. Siéntete libre de. Very good. Excellent. Eh, aquí les voy a dejar el link del video por si lo quieren eh, ver ahí. All right, so. Y este, lo vamos a ir de nuevo a los breakup rooms, people. All right. Y ahí vamos a responder las preguntas eh, con lo que los compañeros puedan aportar. Y si quieren ver el video para reforzar o verificar la información, pues ahí está el link para que you can also check it from your side. All right. Preguntas antes de irnos a los breakup rooms. Yes or no? Mm -hmm. No. Ok. Las preguntas, teacher, las voy a mandar. Creo que ya están en el, en el WhatsApp group. You found no wrong. Ah, okay. Check. Eh, sí, ya están ahí las questions. All right. Okay. So let's go to the rooms then. Teacher ya puso los breakout rooms. No me aparecen porque me metí al video. Who are you? Is it Carla? Oh, sí, who is it? Who was asking? I'm sorry. Carla, was it you? Sí, Carla. Ah, oh, all right. No problem. Es que esos son los mismos de la vez pasada. Entonces, vamos a ver. Oh. One second. Voy a mandar a uno ahorita. Join this one, y yo voy a entrar ahí, all right? Hello, hello. Questions? Hello, teacher. ¿Cómo estamos? ¿Preguntas? ¿Dudas? Hello. Ahorita vamos a comenzar, teacher. Alexa, are you here? Yes. Yes, teacher. All right. El, Alexa va a estar solo oyendo o participando, porque si la mano Ahorita, para alguien más. Sí, no, sí, sí voy a participar, solo una consulta, teacher. Eh, mm -hmm. Vamos a contestar las preguntas. 
Yes, basado en lo que vimos en el video. Uh -huh. oh, ok. Entonces, okay, a Alex se la voy a mover a otro, a otro room donde hay otra persona que está sola. All right. Ok, de acuerdo. All right, thank, thank you. you. Customers. Name. Hola, Ana. ¿Con quién no tengo? Eh, Ana y María. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Thank you. What is the customer's name? Bueno, y Sandrita que está aquí escuchando, así que... Hola. Sí, escuchando, teacher. Yo el nombre no lo alcancé a escuchar. Ah, bueno. Pero... Eh, ¿Copiaron poner... el link y el video? Yes. Si no, que se lo puedo dejar. Ok, teacher. All right, excellent. Take your time, right? Don't worry. I'll be back. Yeah. Fue a través de ellos mismos. Sí. Vaya. La otra es: What was the problem with the reservation? Pay the deposit on the phone. Ok. Was a, a glitch. Yeah, sure. Was a glitch with the booking system. Excellent. Good job. Teacher. <laughs> Hello again. I siempre no asusto. Bye. Entonces la tres ya la tenemos. I I, I have a yeah. question for you. I have a question for you. Guys, right? ustedes cuando se metieron al curso, um, no hicieron un examen de nivelación o decidieron empezar desde el inicio. Eh, sí, hice un examen de nivelación, pero me dijeron de que me tocaba en básico 5, supuestamente, pero uh -huh. que básico 5 no había. Uh -huh. Entonces, que siguiera estudiando así, me dijeron hasta que llegara al básico 5. All right. Bueno, ya casi. All right. So, casi. <laughs> we just finished the three. All right. So, that's it. Uh -huh. And what about you, Nancy? Uh, no, yo decidí de básico, no quise someterme a ninguna prueba porque igual consideraba que no, no podía pasar a otro nivel. Me sentía todavía ahí. Ah, all right, excelente. Sí, Les pregunto, Ray, porque no todo no to un muy buen nivel en ambos y los felicito por eso, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Así que, good job, all right. Thank you. Gracias. All right, continue practicing, please. Ok, ok, thank okay, you, thank teacher. You. Eh, vaya, la tres ya la tenemos, ¿verdad? Sí, ya, ya la tenemos. Tres? Va, sigo. Eh, uh -huh. La cuatro de... Where is the customer from? Es, no, ¿Es, esa no me... es San Francisco. Yeah. Es... Did you... Information or travel? Did you... Did you... Did you... Sí, cabal, eso era a través de ellos. Ahí dice cuál era el problema de la reservación, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. No, 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 Booking system. All right. Eh, William. Mande, mande, teacher. All right. Ese eh, está bien. Esa es la respuesta, de hecho. All right. So, solamente la pronunciación no es white, sino que es with. 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 All right. Exactly. Yeah. There was a glitch with the booking system. Was a glitch. Así, glitch. Mm -hmm. What? The... ¿Cómo es, teacher? Perdón. With. 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 Uh -huh. With. What yes. a ese, ese sonido que lleva al final es como la Z española. La Z de ah. España. Entonces sería with. With, with the with. Book, booking. With system. the booking system. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. The yes. With the booking. With. Yes. With the booking system. Excellent. Thank you for participating. Okay. Cualquier duda, please let me know. I'm going to be here. All right? Okay, teacher. Thank okay. You. okay. Yo creo que... Quiero ver... Hello. 
Hello, teacher. Hello. 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 Do you need help? Mm. Any help or not? Mm, no, 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 teacher. Creo no. que no. Ahorita estamos escribiendo la. Ver por la tercera pregunta, All right. Excellent, excellent, excellent. No problem. Okay. Bye. Uh -huh. Comparto el video siempre, Ana Luisa. Sí, por. Quiero ver. Para, para, para. Hola Ana Luisa. Hola. Eh, Hola. Te pregunta cuál es el problema con la reservación en en quiero ver en la tres verdad. Sí. Sería con el booking system. Ajá. Correcto. Dice que maybe there was a glitch with the booking system que había habido como una falla verdad. Ajá, That's una right. Falla en el sistema. ¿Mm? That's correct. Entonces, ¿cómo podríamos poner? A glitch. O there was a glitch. There was, porque sería pasado. There was a glitch, ¿verdad? Correct. There was a glitch with the booking system. Mm -hmm. Booking system. Ok. <coughs> Where is the customer from? Eh, ¿De dónde es el cliente, verdad? That is correct. Uy. De San Francisco. Yay. No. That's right. That is correct. Dice que es de San Francisco, entonces, ¿verdad? That is correct. Uh -huh. yes. Ok. San Francisco. Después le pregunta cuál es la actividad. Ah, la conferencia, ¿verdad? Business That's conference. Cool. A business conference, exactly. Business conference. Ok. Bueno, voy a escribir cómo me han quedado a mí. Mira acá. Tiene que estar igual. <ríe> Eso. <ríe> Sanders. 
La segunda. Teacher, en la segunda cuando, bueno, eh, pregunta de que cómo le hizo para reservar. Uh -huh. Se puede poner así, it directly. No sé cómo se pronunciaba. Through. 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 Podemos dejarlo como directly through you, through, through the hotel. Ah, uh -huh. directly, directly, directly through the hotel. Through the hotel. Correct. Ok. Directly, directly through the hotel, exactly. Hotel. There was, there was a glitch. All right, excellent. So we are going to stop right here because it's time to go back. All right. Okay, teacher. Booking system. System Cuatro San Francisco Sí Oh my God, Erling, enjoy it. Thank you, teacher. All right, you're welcome. Okay, we are going to start here. We have the five questions there, so we can um, review what are the answers, right? So let's see, who wants to help me with question number one? Question number one. Hello? Easy, people. Super easy. Facilísima. Huh? Question number one. What is the customer's name? Thank you. And what's the answer, Carlita? Tom Sanders. Tom Sanders. Yes or no, people? Yes, teacher. Yes. Right. Thank you very much. All right. Excellent. So then let's continue with number two. Number two, volunteer. Me teacher. All right, early. Read the question and then give me the answer, please. Okay. How did the customer book the reservation? Mm -hmm. And the answer is directly through the hotel. Directly through the hotel. Very good job. Yeah. Amazing. Good job, job. All right. Thank you. What about uh, the question number three? Volunteer. Me teacher. Thank you, Nancy. Tell me, please. What was the problem with the reservation? Mm -hmm. Was a glitch with the booking system. A glitch with the booking system. That is correct. Thank you very much. All right. Good job, Nancy. Thank you, everybody. Number four. Hi. Hello, Anna. Tell me. Where is the customer from? Where is the customer he is, from? He is of San Francisco. He is from... San Francisco. San Francisco. Very good job. Excellent. Thank you. Uh, that was amazing. Number five. Five. Mm -hmm. Come on. The last one. Mm -hmm. uh, he assists business conference. Ah, uh, okay. Thank you. Ana, right? Ana Luisa. Yes. That was you. All right. Thank you. So it will be this one. So, pero tenemos un verbo equivocado ahí. Anita me utilizó okay. assist. ¿Y cuál era? Sí. Attend. Attend. The business conference. Attend. Exactly, right? Thank you very much. All right, excellent. Congratulations, everybody. You were doing a very good job uh, answering these questions, right? Super, super nice, right? Así de esa manera ustedes pueden darse cuenta cómo su comprensión va mejorando, right? So, ya sea porque estás leyendo what happened, sir, or because you're listening to that, all right? So, thank you. Very good job. Now, we are going to um, go with here with a new one. Vamos a irnos al manual. All right, so, and we are going to do this activity here, which is this one. It's the activity number five. Eh, si ustedes tienen su manual ahí, es la página 40. All right, so we go on this one here. 
it is just about associating like um, the um, vocabulary that we have right here. All right, excellent. So what are we going to do? It's gonna be actually very simple, very simple, 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 simple. So tell me, everybody, vamos a ver here. Tenemos el primero, que es el shuttle service. All right, so what number is the shuttle service here? Wait a call. Wait no. a call. No, no, no. The shuttle service. Estamos ahorita con el shuttle service. Okay. Sería la número siete. Number seven. Number seven. Number seven. All right. Aunque, <laughs> let's say this one right here. Eh, Giovanni tenía razón si hablamos el número uno, right? So let's say this one. Entonces sería, everybody, shuttle service is number seven. Right? seven. So let's say this one right here. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. There you go. Exactly, right? There you go. Number seven, shuttle service. Thank you. Okay, excellent. So then you go on this one right here. What is going to be this one, ladies and gentlemen? So the single, sorry, the single room. Single room, single room, single room. What is it? Six. Number six. six. Number, Number six. six. Exactly, right? So that is correct. That's gonna be like here, like this one. All right, so it's gonna be single room. Very good, excellent. Thank you. What about a wake up call? I wanna see, what is it? Number, Number one. 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 Exactly, one. right? So this is like wake up call. There you go. Excellent. So what about Wi-Fi internet? That's fácil. Number eight. eight. I'm going to just put it right here. Wi-Fi. No hay para donde ahí. Right? Oops. There you go. Excellent. So what about business center? Four. Four. Number four. Four. Number four. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Yes, porque están las personas discussing, right? So... Business center. Vamos a abreviar. All right, business center. There you go. All right, so what about fridge in the room? Number three. Number, Number three. three. Remember la palabra fridge es refrigerador. All right, so fridge in the room. Fridge. All right, very good, excellent. And then we have a safe. safe. Number, five. Number five. five. Exactly, what's the meaning of safe, people? Uh, what what? Excuse me. Seguro. Seguro, seguro, seguro. Más que seguridad, seguro. Es un adjetivo. Exactly. You, you did it good. Y la última sería. Number two. Number two, que sería. Laundry service. Nice. Laundry service. Very good job. Excellent. So you did a fantastic here. Questions about the vocabulary, people? No questions? No, no questions. Teacher, lo de las siete, ¿podría volver a repetir qué significa? Oh, sure. Shuttle service es un servicio de transporte entre el aeropuerto y el hotel y viceversa. All right, so yes. Gracias. You're welcome. All right, excellent, excellent. So more questions about this vocabulary? No? Okay, cool, no problem. So let's set this one right here. Okay, continuamos siempre en el, um, you know, in the manual here, pero ahora vamos a enfocarnos en activity number six, which is basically here. Let's zoom in. Excellent, veamos. It says right here, let's read the instruction. It says, write a checklist about the type of services and amenities you need for your next trip. Use words from the box and include your own, all right? So who wants to help me to read the instruction again? All right, read it, read it, read it. What is the instruction here? Uh-huh. Oh, thank you, Gorlita, appreciate it. Eh, que lo lee en inglés, teacher. <laughs> yes. Eh, dice, write a checklist about the type of service and amenities you need for your next trip. 
Use words from the box and include your own. Thank you very much. That's it. All right. ¿Qué vamos a hacer aquí? Una checklist. ¿Qué es una checklist, people? Como, la Como que... una lista. Lista. Una lista de cosas por hacer. Sobre los tipos de servicios y amenities que necesitas para tu siguiente viaje. Right? Es sí. decir, eh, digamos, en sí. mi siguiente viaje al hotel, yo necesito un hotel que tenga piscina, gimnasio, gimnasio. wifi, todo lo que hemos visto ahora. All right? Yes. Sí, yes. pero ya está para mascota, ¿verdad? Yes, all right. ¿Cómo se dice? De hecho, gracias por el separatorio. Se dice pet friendly. You know, pet friendly. Ese es como acepta mascotas, right? All right, excellent. Entonces, esa será nuestra última activity de tonight, right? Lo vamos a hacer en los breakout rooms para que podamos discutir ahí que es lo que eh, tendrían unos. Remember, no tiene que ser lo mismo. Por ejemplo, si está trabajando Ana en William, Ana tiene su checklist y William tiene su checklist y la compartimos ahí. All right? We share it. Yes? We share. Para contestar yes. sería I have. No. It would be eh, this one right here. Okay. I want a hotel with y empezamos to tell this one. Right? I want a hotel with. Quiero un hotel con o oh, okay. podemos cantar a la one for I need a hotel with. All right. Necesito un hotel con. Y empezamos con las amenidades. I need a hotel with a swimming pool, with uh, the front desk, with the bell service, etc. All right. Understand? Okay, teacher. Excellent. That's super easy, right? So let's just go back to the rooms so we can participate. And we will just be there for like a couple of minutes so then we can share the answers. Go ahead, please, and join the rooms. Very good. Everybody here. Charles. Well, Jay Tres, que was swimming pool. Indoor pool, puede ser, ajá. Ajá, so, swimming pool. Gym, también. Uh, the, the laundry. Ajá, laundry service. Mm -hmm. Laundry service. You could, the add, service. you could add to the next, to the exercise, for example, this year. Uh, on my next trip, en mi siguiente viaje, I will, I will go to, voy a ir a, y mencionan un lugar, for example. On my next trip, I will go to Los Angeles. And oh, I need a hotel. Okay. And I need a hotel with swimming pool, non-smoking rooms, for example. Right? Ah, okay. O las demás que están mencionando. For smoke. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. On, on my next trip. Uh -huh. I will... I will go. I will go. Or it will go. No, I, porque serías yo iría. Yo uh -huh. iría. Uh -huh. I will go. I will go. To? To. Podría ser Santa Ana's Volcán. That's fine. Uh -huh. O vol Santa Ana's Volcán, no sería, ¿verdad? ¿no? Volcán, o yo Santa Ana, you know, no, no complicated. Además, no hay hotel en Santa Ana, Volcán. <ríe> so... <ríe> ok. Y... ¿Qué se dice Cerro Verde? Hay un hotel. Right. Ah, en el Cerro Verde. Right? Yes, 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 yes. Mm. There you go. Cerro Verde. Ok, if you need help, just call me. I'll be back, all right? Ok, thank, thank you. you. Thank you.
Connection Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi connection. Wi-Fi connection. Hello. Right, so yes. Wi-Fi connection. Shuttle service, podría ser. Ah, también shuttle service. Roberto Hotel, ¿verdad? Yeah. Sería en... I need a laundry service. Ajá. Uh -huh. De ahí sería. Sí, ¿no? La otra, ¿cómo era la piscina? Uh. A swimming pool. Swimming pool, ok. Swimming pool. Okay. I need, I want. Un salón. Pero es Skylon. Sky <laughs> Un salón. Hola, Tisha. Hey, hola. Hello. Eh, ya tenemos algunas, eh, si quieres se las digo, solo hemos mencionado, ¿verdad? Okay. pero no, no hemos armado la... Eh, primero, gym, cook working, eh, the pool, the grilling, sky lunch y playroom. Sky, sky lunch. Ajá, es como salón, eh, okay. así como de convivencia. Es que mmm, eh, eh, no sé, como una sala para compartir así el... Pero podría ser claro. una business conference o, o una business, ¿cómo sería? O un business room, perhaps, business center, un centro de negocios, o or... no divertirse así como con los compañeros, con los amigos. Pero en un hotel. Creo que son áreas, por ejemplo, la, la pool, que sería la piscina, o el restaurant, uh -huh. o el bar. Ok. Uh -huh. Pero esas serían amenidades, ¿o no? Claro, right, of course. El bar, el restaurant, la swimming pool son beneficios, right? Los amenidades, of course. Y los que nosotros estamos escribiendo también, ¿no? Yes, of course. Sí, co-working. Un lugar de trabajo, ¿verdad? Ajá, coworking. The ajá. grilling, ajá, the grilling es como de parrilla, creo, no sé, asado. Grilling, Para ser asado. Ah, right, excelente. Sí, uh -huh. um, pero eso depende de los hoteles, ¿verdad? Right? Porque I have never seen a grilling section. A menos que sea un hotel de playa. All right. Uh -huh. eh, bueno, he puesto, eh, I want a hotel with pet playground. Playground, eh, ajá. Para los niños. From... So. No, no, no. Pet playground. Ah, all right. Para los pets. All right. Sí. Eh, from of the beach, swimming okay. pool, restaurant, and snack bar. Okay. That's nice. Y eso me suena al de Cameron. Right. So, very good. Let's no, see. Ahí no tienen para mascotas. It's true. It's true. All right. Excellent. So, let's go to the main session so we can finish with this activity. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Hey, everybody, welcome back. All right. Let's see, let's see. All right. Bye. Para que no solo uno participe, me van a dar cinco personas, five people, you're going to give me one of those things here. All right. So this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. All right. So let's see, who wants to give me the first amenity? Mm -hmm. Volunteer for the first amenity? Oh, thank you, Erling. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hey. Just one? Just one, yes. Okay, let me uh, swimming pool. 
A swimming pool. All right. Swimming pool. Excellent. Thank you. Anybody else? Mm. Wi-Fi connection. Wi-Fi. All right. Thank you. Anybody else? Service room. Oh, excuse me, Anna. Service room. Al revés. Room service. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Next. 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 Excuse me. Snack bar. Do you say bar? Yes. Snack bar. Un bar de snack. <laughs> snack bar. Mm -hmm. All right. Excellent. Yeah. La, la barra de golosinas. All right. Exactly. And the last one. Shuttle service. Excellent. All right. Shuttle service. Very good job. Excellent, everybody. So you have been doing a fantastic job with this one right here. All right. And now let's see this one. It's time for us to go to sleep. All right. But before we go to sleep, you know, help me with this one, right? It says like, no, unable to request information about travel services, accommodations for a business, all right? Y manejamos este vocabulary, right? So remember, independientemente, all right? So you actually help me send a data sticker, all right? Uh, with occasional helps and this one, and only with helps and this one. Puede reaccionar o mandar al group, al chat, all right? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That's Nancy, Ana Luisa, Maria, Ana Elizabeth, Noemi. Oh, hello, Noemi. All right. So, Mauricio. All right. Carla Milena, William Giovanni. Thank you. Alexa. Thank you very much. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Thank you, everybody here. Okay. So, we are going to stop right here. All right. So, thank you very much for participating in the activities tonight, people. And don't forget, ¿verdad? Ponerse al día con las tareas este fin de semana, please. All right, do your homework. And I will see you on Monday. Have a nice weekend. Good night. Bye. All right, excellent. Alguien por ahí me pidió la palabra? Yes. Yo, yo teacher. Erling. Este, sí, le quería preguntar. Eh, este miércoles termina el, el curso. Yes. Si no me equivoco, es el jueves, creo. El jueves. Ah, ok, mm -hmm. ok. Thank you, teacher. Yes, yes. Así que no see me equivoco. See you on Monday. All right, so see no. you on Monday. <laughs> bye, bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye, bye. 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 bye.